Um, I have a couple different injuries. Uh, the first one I sustained in 2004 during a snowmobile accident. I hit a tree and injured my back and my hip. And, um, and then in 2007, I was diagnosed with a heart condition and later that day had a stroke as a result of the heart condition. Traumatic brain injury uh, person. I've had uh, a series of, of, of both concussive blasts and impacts to the back of my head. After the third, fourth ones, then those problems really magnified. And then I started to have a lot more physical uh, issues like balance. My, my inner left inner ear is, is permanently damaged, so I have balance problems. Um, I drift left when I run. I drift left when I ride a bike. But then after I had the stroke, it actually occurred just a few minutes after one of my workouts. And in my mind, I associated the two, even though they weren't technically related. But uh, so after that happened, I pretty much just stopped training altogether. Um, and that was hard for me because, like I said, it had been my life up to that point. Um, and so competing in the games last year really got me back in the gym, back to, the, to what I love to do. And, uh, and it's actually introduced me to some new things because I can't power lift anymore and I can't do some of the things I used to do. But uh, it's introduced me to a whole world of other options. I have helped improve my, my daily uh, life, just being more active. Um, I feel like I'm more able to cope with normal everyday things that come up at work or, or, or in, in my personal you know, daily living that, you know, this is, this is no big deal. So what? I'm in, stuck in traffic right now, you know. So uh, I felt I faced bigger challenges, you know, having to run again or, or, or push myself doing a sport. So. The uh, sports has, has, and athletics have really uh, done amazing things for our wounded warriors and all somebody would have to do would be to, to take a few minutes and to visit one of the venues here at the Wounded Warrior Games. Uh, these uh, events are, are having not just a, a, a create a goal for our service members to be able to uh, work towards and be competitive, but it's also giving them a major psychological lift. They can see that no matter what their injury, no matter what, what uh, their challenge is, they can uh, athletically uh, perform at a very high level. I would have hated to have missed out on the opportunity to do this again, just because it's so incredible to be part of that team. Uh, and to be around other people who have similar issues to yours. Um, you know, we, I have a lot of support from my family and friends back home, but unless you've been through something like this, it's a little hard for them to relate even. So uh, for me, it's just amazing to be here and, and be part of this team. Athletics has so much team sport about it that it really gives our service members a chance to in interact with one another every day. And now when they're injured, they're able to come together as a team and get better together. A lot of injured, wounded service members, once they become that, in that status, they, they lose that sense of camaraderie and brotherhood that, and sisterhood that you get in the military. And coming to a competition like this where you're representing your branch of service, it, it brings you back into that, that camaraderie and that brotherhood. And, and so that's a key thing. I think it's an amazing impact. Uh, like I said, we all become a family, which is really important for us because sometimes we feel like we're going through something alone. And uh, it really shows each and every one of us that we have support out there. Anytime you're having a low point in your competition or training and you see someone else struggling with a, a, a different medical condition and you're looking at them dealing with it, you know, that you draw strength from that and inspiration from that. It changes your life. It kind of gives you a new motivation, a new focus, and um, and like I said, opens up opens up a whole world of other opportunities for you.